Hello, people. I am Javi Kawei. Joining us is Achara Kirk. Hello. We're gonna look at a remake called Flatliners. I am so stoked for this. I was a really, really big fan of the movie as a kid, and the actors, the cast yeah. that was in Flatliners, I thought they were great as well. So I'm really intrigued to see what they've done with this, what they've updated, the visual effects, yeah. you know, all that stuff. I'm just really curious. Do you have plans tonight? Do you wanna have fun with me later? Courtney Holmes, I am mildly surprised, but offer accepted. Midnight basement sublevel C. What's going on? I would like you to stop my heart. You give it one minute, and then you bring me back. Okay, now's the point where you say it's all a joke. Oh, wait, updated the gadgets and whatnot. <laughs> it's not just a little ice vest. Right, it's yeah. It's a whole bunch of other stuff. What happens to us after we die? Three minutes. Jamie only did two. What can I say? We're competitive. I'm going next. Five minutes. What? Seven minutes. Yeah, they, no they, one's they, ever come back from that. They keep trying to one-up each other. That's scary. Was it all fun? Here we go. Was there anything disturbing? Yep. Something is happening to us. I think I'm going crazy. Maybe we opened the door. What? Something is coming for us. Something I did. Something I did. Where? Defense, she's not stabilizing. This experiment needs to end right now. I did not know that the side effects would show up and start hunting us down. Holy. This was my fault. Damn, they really up the ante. Yeah. So they made this way scarier than the first one was. Yeah, because I don't remember being that scary, although to be fair, I don't really remember too much about it, but as a kid, if I watched something scary, I, I remember that. Well, the thing about the original Flatliners was it was more of a psychological thriller, whereas this is more like kind of bordering on horror. Yeah. The way it's portraying the imagery and her being dragged on the ground and all that, that stuff. Yeah, it's classic. Like, the, I remember this scene where... I forget which character it was, but this guy was haunted by this little black girl who kept berating the shit out of him. And he didn't, like, he knew who it was. It was some girl that he used to antagonize when he was a little kid. Oh. And so he had to go find her and, like, reconcile their differences. And, like, basically it was about addressing some of the sins from your past and putting them to rest. Um, basically, you know, dealing with our skeletons in the closet. And mm -hmm. here it looks like they've taken that idea and really accelerated it to 9,000 RPMs. Yeah. You know, taking it to a whole new level. The visual effects is, there's way more visual effects, or, or special effects for that matter, uh -huh. than the original one had. The production value is way yeah. bigger. The original one, like, they were, I believe they were uh, flatlining themselves inside of a church or some kind of temple or something. It, yeah. looked, it felt like something a lot more empty, not like, so sophisticated. Yeah. I'm still interested. I still want to check it out. There was only one moment in the trailer that bothered me, and it was when the girl goes, it's like something rewired her brain. I'm like, wow, <laughs> wait a spoon for you to the information. Did that happen in the original where they, they were changed by it? They were definitely changed, but they weren't given gifts. Like special skills. I don't remember yeah. them having any kind of powers or gifts, but that's, you know, a way to modernize it and make it more interesting for the current audience. Yeah. I still think that you could have had a, a complete remake of the original script and just kind of updated it to the modern times 
in terms of like how much more sophisticated we are today right. with our gadgets and whatnot, ne not necessarily making it into like a pseudo X-Men horror movie. I don't think you necessarily needed to go there, but this is a legitimate way to go and I'm definitely intrigued and want to check it out. Yeah. So it's got my 10 bucks. Yeah, I mean, yeah. it certainly feels different. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. If you have seen the original Flatliners, let us know in the comments what you think of it. If you haven't seen the original Flatliners, are you intrigued? Does do you like the concept? Have you ever seen a movie like this? I want to I want to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Check out our other reactions, reviews, short films, and video game related videos and Achara Kirk's um, stuff. Ha! <laughs> yes.